hello friends radhika ravikma here so today we'll see how to create tables and in inserting values into those tables using sql so here uh, our um, sql plus application is open so first let us create a table to create a table you need to give a syntax like this that is create sorry create table followed by the table name you can give any uh, any name that you want but it's always good to give the some you know, name that is related to the contents of those tables so my table contents is going to be um, you know based on some details of then employee okay so i'll give it as employee um, tbl that is employee table in short form so open bracket within the brackets i'm going to have all the uh, columns that is going to come under this table so first column of my table is going to be employee id so it's emp underscore id this is my uh, uh, column name and uh, we all know that usually ids will be you know in integer that is numbers right so i'm this data type that uh, you know you should be giving the column name followed by the data type so the data type for the my employee id column is going to be uh, integer so it's int in short form then this uh, employee id is going to be my primary key and uh, as well as when i say primary key obviously it is uh, going to be not null value that is null values cannot occupy this column so i'm going to say now not null this is the keyword then followed by primary key then uh, in order to separate two columns you need to give a, a, a comma like this then uh, the next column that is going to come under my employee table is um, employee name so the employee name we all know it's an al alphabet it's a combination of alphabet so i'm going to say varchar the data type is going to be varchar um, and i'm going to give the you know how many how much of bytes is required uh, for the name i'm going to give some uh, value like 20 so each name will be within 20 bytes then varchar and even this is going to be not null because i don't want null values to be present in these columns then the next will be something like location and the location as well as will have uh, varchar so let us close here close the table here let us create a table okay then in order to create a table the finally you need to give a semicolon just type enter can see that the table is created so this is how you will create a table in order to see the structure of this table just say dsc that is describe the table name our table name is employee underscore tbl you can see that our table is already created but the values are not present yet so um, in this tutorial we have learned how to create a table so next for the upcoming tutorial we will learn how to insert values into a table okay so thank you very much for watching my video